Oh. Three, two, one. Three, two, one. All right, guys, what's up? I want to do a little video telling you guys what kind of battery life I've been getting out of my T-Rex 2 by Amazfit. So I had the original T-Rex first, and the battery life wasn't fantastic on it. Um, I was having to charge it, uh, you know, once every three or four days, probably. Um, on the Amazfit T-Rex 2, it's way better. So first of all, I'll show you my settings, health monitoring. I've got the auto heart rate set on 30 minutes, and then I have the active rate monitoring turned on. So when it detects me doing a physical activity, when it detects me walking, playing basketball, something like that, then it increases the monitor uh, monitoring frequency. I don't know how much it increases it, but um, if I'm just sitting around at my desk or something, then it's every 30 minutes. Uh, I have all my notifications on uh, and all that stuff. So as far as battery life, you can see I'm at 49% and my last charge was 10 days ago. So I'm getting 20 days. I'm getting base almost three weeks out of a battery charge and i absolutely love it this has been one of the best wearables that i've ever owned um, as far as battery life which surprises me because uh it's it's pretty large i expected it to be kind of a battery hog um, now i'm sure it probably would be if i more actively used the gps features but i really only use those a couple times on the weekends to record motorcycle rides um, or very specific um, exercise activity so I'm not using the GPS all the time I'm sure that would suck a lot more battery but uh, this watch has been a pleasure to own I know I've done some videos about how the GPS was a little gimmicky um, it's okay uh, the rest of the watch has been great uh, I have I have banged and clanged this thing and got it covered in dirt and grease and the thing still looks brand new I, I don't know it's I don't know how they've done it. I swear, too, I swear that I put some scratches on the screen, and I was like, oh, bummer, I scratched the screen, and then I would come back the next day, and the scratches are gone. And I don't even understand how that's possible, but I'm not complaining. Um, been stuck on this watch face for a while, really like it. Really just wish this was a desert khaki. Um, but this matches, this wild green matches my phone case. So it's a pretty cool, pretty cool setup. If you guys are interested in a video about this phone case um, and my setup with it on my Samsung Galaxy uh, Note 20 Ultra, let me know and I'll make a video on that. So, but we're running the wild green setup for this year. Uh, maybe switch to desert khaki uh, for 2023. We will see. All right, guys, thanks for watching. Highly recommend the Amazfit watches. See you in the next video.